So this is going to be like a recap of the year, bro. This should be very interesting, man. We had a very interesting year. A lot of cool trends, a lot of lame trends. I feel like the coolest trend, though, was definitely them AI captions, bro. Them AI cartoon captions, the hood captions. <laughs> elite, bro. Elite. They made my, my timeline when I was on Instagram or all social, uh, social media, bro. For real. But we're going to see. 2023 a time to be alive 2023 was a very interesting year to say the least but today we're going over everything that made 2023 so memorable in a nutshell first i think it's appropriate we start off with ai, AI took over now, for AI real i was on the rise at the end oh of 2022, exactly but no one really started using ai just for memes and trends and like that until 2023 people started creating the most devious most out of pocket disney movie posters with AI. yeah okay listen and that but that took it way too far i'm not gonna lie the, we could have stopped at the hood captions but then when they start introducing them the disney ai posters oh hell no i was seeing twin towers i was seeing uh 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 slave Poster, bro. I've seen all types of drones, bro. Like, it was weird. You're gonna risk showing like the extremely, out especially foolish. Yeah, foolish, crazy, crazy ones. But hey, bro, just all, all you gotta know is I'm going finding to water. Got it. Waterway. That looks like it's heat. You already know I'm riding deep in there with my mobility scooter just to see my favorite. Th it's your fault. That's that's calm. Nick Akato, that's Akato. tame. The goat. But another thing to come out of 2023 that's considered a trend, I guess, is skibbity toilet. And of course, yeah, I'm not rocking what? this one. I mean, again, I'm not. Yo, y'all know what that is, bro? Listen, I be on social media, but I'm be on social media like that. So if I don't know this, bro, don't call me old, cause I'm not. The primary age demographic. I mean, props to this guy. Like, dude's dude's running up the bills right now. But I guess like these YouTube shows became a thing this year. There was another one that came out. It was called Digital Circus. Now I don't know much about it. I think it came out like a month ago. And again, obviously, I'm not gonna find it appealing if it's. Honestly, I don't know what he's like, talking about. Man, bro, I basically got that 401k account at this point. But of course, a lot of memes and things like that have sparked out of these shows. Like, a lot of words have just been added to skibbity. Like, skibbity Riz, skibbity Ohio. Like, it just doesn't make any sense. Like, I don't know. Now that I think about it, yo, this this year, the only thing we got that was good, bro, was that, was the AI shit. Apart from that, bro, it's been pretty dry. Who is crafting these memes or slang? Like, I don't know who if is crafting correctly. this slang. Like, seriously, what does that even mean? Like, I don't know. The, the slang this year was so bad. I'm just going to keep it a buck. We had words like Ohio. Riz, oh, yeah. Yacht, Phantom Tax. Like, I don't know, man. I'm just and my worst one, yeah, bro. You're yapping. You're yapping. Like, hey. like it's my job to yap, bro. G -G 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 Yo, Supreme, appreciate that. Six months. Come on, gang. Bro, y'all just say yap over everything. You talk, you're yapping. Like, shut up, bro. Literally, you're the one that should shut up. I'm just not rocking with it. And then someone ended up making a song that went viral with all these slang words. Like, I'm sorry, bro, but who is what? saying that? That is like the most f***ing cringe ever, dude. You're sticking out your get for the Rizzler. Oh, so no. Nah. Never did I want to just... You see that? It was the emo. It was the emo guy. Yo, Supreme with a five. Big five. Came in rocking. Appreciate you. Listen, y'all seen the emo guy? It was like, stick it out for the Rizzler, Phantom Tax, or whatever that he was saying. Cringe. Can slice my ears off more in my life than after hearing that. Now, AMP has a lot to do with like the recent. But like, that's crazy that people have there so much too? emotion that they basically control like what people say and like that's the slang true. words that are out. That is insane to think about. And of course. Yo, Chad, we should create our own slang, bro. Listen, right? What do I be saying a lot? I'm not gonna lie, I be saying grits a lot. Like that, that's grits. You know what I'm saying? Listen, chat, this is between us, all right? We we won't we won't make this a worldwide thing. Like I know grits is the word, but I, the way I be saying it is like I be like if it's done and dusted, well like how do, how do I put it into perspective? I'll be like, yo, that's grits, bro. Like it's grits. Like it's done, it's finished. Like I don't know how to put it in like, I don't know, but like, you know what I'm saying? Alright, I'ma shut up, bro. Ten gifted. Oh my God, Supreme! Crazy! We gonna work on it, chat. We gonna work on slam. That was it. It was over. Yeah, grits. G R I T Z. We can't forget. It's grits. Referee. 
this dude is a go all right like i don't care what you say he's just making sure the ladies are all right like he's doing yeah it's like it's like saying it's over with bro it's over with it's done it's done it's grits man it's great yeah listen you can't tell me that's not five bro bro like bro say your team down by like 10 point bro like it's 10 point yeah it's grits man right what That's fine, bro. And I, I, hey, listen, everybody that says that, listen, just know it started here, bro. It started right here. I don't care. And I, nobody can claim this. Yo, Supreme, and give it a five. Damn. Carrying the, yo, everybody finna have a badge at this point. Doing his job. Bro. Oh, all right, I'm gonna let the vid rock a little bit, bro. Like, this dude is just hilarious. W Slam, come on. Like, how did he even conceive of, like, these catchphrases? Like, life is Roblox, let's go golfing, bring out the lobster. Like, how did these even happen? I don't know. But this meme of Khaled dialed in in the studio just went crazy this year. But yeah, DJ Khaled was a very prominent figure in the year, I must was say. Was he? But yeah, rap has been on the rise this year. There's so many artists uh, that are just popping off at the moment. Like, <laughs> Ken Carson, Destroy Lonely, and of course, we cannot forget... Ice Spice, bro. How could I forget, man? The main, it's probably the main aspect of 2023, right? Ice Spice. Ugh. The best artist to come out of 2023. Best See, is like, crazy. There's a difference between Ice Spice and Beethoven. Ice Spice is just good. Like, fuck Beethoven. It's all about Ice Spice. If Ice Spice has 10 fans, I'm one. If Ice Spice has no fans, I'm dead. But I'm the, the worst thing to come out of 2023, not even the slang, bro. Not even the AI, bro. It's the munchkins. It's the munches, bro. And I ain't going to lie. I might be one of them, but who knows? <laughs> All jokes aside, her music's not like insane or anything, but it's all right. But there's a reason why she rose to fame. And everyone knows that reason. Can't just quite put my finger on it. You know, as much as I wish I could put my finger on it. Nah, what the f did I just say? Okay, pause. All right, we're going to forget about it. But yeah, her looks pretty much just carried her to fame. It's, her, it's not even her really. looks, bro. It's just that dumb truck. Let's be honest, bro. It's literally just a dumb chart, bro. It's the gats. Like, there are many dudes that are just down bad for Ice Spice. They'll literally do fucking anything, bro. Rap has been on the rise because a lot of people have been hopping on YouTube and Twitch streams to really get their name out. But in 2023, streaming has gone crazier than it's ever had, bro. Like, it's, it's insane. There's people like Speed. Yo, tune into the streams, man. Tune into the streams, you feel me? Hey, listen. Kai, Aiden, that are really all on the rise right now and are some of the most popular people on the internet right now. Like, Kai had Lil Baby on his stream this year. Like, that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. But I ain't gonna lie, though. That's a fire crossover. But it's crazy A Y D much streaming has grown, like, in the nah. last year or so. But yeah, I figured I had to mention it. Because it's one of the most consumed types of media. But there was also Where's AYD? I'm saying, man. Like, where, where am I? Hey, you know, I'm playing. I'm still... Wait, hey, listen, chat. This is the come up, bro. Everybody here right now, you on the come up, bro. You, you we, we, we here. Like, we start from the mud, you know what I'm saying? Why? We gonna be up there, though. Like, listen, everybody gonna know the AYD game. Simple like that, bro. Simple, simple. That simple. was poo. That was... That no one wants to consume. This was the year that the Velma show came out. We cannot forget about the f***ing Velma show. This sh was straight buns. I don't know who was sitting there like, yeah, I'm watching Velma when it drops. Like, they completely got rid of the character. Why are they black? From Scooby-Doo and just made it what a the completely Yo. different character. Like, what the f***? This is not how I remember Scooby Doo. Like, the worst reboot I have ever seen in my entire life. But people, of course, all over the internet were talking about it because of how fucking trash it was. And no, I didn't watch it because there's no point. Yo, Tony over the tier one. It's trash. I already know it is. Like I've seen clips. Appreciate that. Reacting to it and Jesus Christ, it's just bad. Yeah, I don't remember that, bro. If this is the best thing to come out 2023, I'm scared, bro. We had here then <laughs> down at night with a bowl of popcorn and watching velma absolutely nobody but i also know nah. for a fact that nobody is watching winnie the pooh blood and honey huh like what the hell? who even came up with the idea for this it was such a terrible idea i don't know who is sitting down in the box office being like you know what we should do we should take a character from a children's movie and oh, make it into a horror i did not i didn't I see this movie thought like this was a meme but no it was it was actually a movie like i can buy it right now on youtube for 4.99 but that's gonna be the biggest waste of money of all time because at this point i'd rather buy a fucking subway sandwich than watch that shit. like I'd hey be hey listen why are you whoa 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 yo get subway me out your mouth bro where the 
why you why you on Subway's meat, bro? Yo, listen, I don't care. I, I I hate hearing this Subway slander. You're making your own sandwich, dog. Like, if you don't mess with Subway, it's because of you. more satisfied with the end result and like jesus christ like it looks so fucking creepy what did they do to my boy poo they did him dirty like no nah, why he looked like that but of course there were good movies this year too like there was the mario movie the fnaf movie was okay i actually watched it it, it was decent and there was also the puss in boot yo is it bad i didn't see none of these movies Wow. This movie. It was a pretty good movie from what I heard. And of course, we can't forget a good show that I actually watched the entire thing. Wednesday. I was fucking with Wednesday, bro. I'm not gonna lie. But hey, man, it may or may not be. Yo, Supreme, you and Dan, bro. Stop it, bro. Show one day, and he was like, yo, Jenna Ortega is in That's love, movie. though. You're gonna wanna watch. But no, I don't want you to be in debt because of me, bro. Familiar. I watched the show, and God. I didn't oh watch any God. of this, man. Like, I must not have lived in 2023, bro. I'm just keeping it real, bro. But yeah, Jenna Ortega aside, it still was a pretty good show. But yeah, let's go over fashion a little bit in 2023. Now, I made an entire video on this already, but there was some goofy fashion to come out this year like the big red boots okay like, yeah who is repping yeah, that bro i'm yeah, sorry nah. that same company's just been producing goofy ass shoes ever since and i'm pretty sure those johns are a lot of money too like there's absolutely no way i'm copying like i'm just never gonna look at those and be like damn bro those are heat like i'm literally just gonna look like fucking astro boy rocking those then we can't forget about the ball clava it's like a knitted face mask pretty much y'all trying to be hood soap i feel like if you wear this it's like you trying to be something you're not bro like take it off man I'm pretty sure Yeet started wearing it, and of course, it became a wave, like, with a lot of people in, like, the rap scene. Like, I saw people at a concert wearing these things, like, in the middle of f***ing summer. Like, it just does not fit in the middle of summer, bro. I'm sorry. Like, I'm just gonna look like I'm robbing a gas station if I'm walking around wearing one of those. I'm but of saying. Course, it's Generation Z, you know, we're on social media all the time. We can't forget about the it's new too hot to be wearing media that, bro. apps that have surfaced in 2023, such as Instagram threads. Yeah, I've never seen a platform tank so fast, so quickly. It's actually crazy. No one can use this shit anymore. It was literally alive for a week and then it just died. Like it was straight up to be seen dead. after that. And I think it's just because, I mean, we already have Twitter. Or when I get it's X dot Like no one's calling it X. I'm sorry, but oh yeah, that also happened in 2023. We can't forget about. Why did they change it to X, man? I still don't know to this X? day. Like, are you so uh, basically threads yeah it was just made to compete with twitter and it just was not gonna work it was just way and every time i send a tweet it sounds like i'm sh it, it, it looks like i'm showing um something i'm not supposed to be showing if you get what i'm saying too similar to twitter so people eventually kind of just went back to twitter but yeah i peeped this app in the app store it's called lemon 8 i think it's just a social media platform where you can share and then you can also like buy stuff on it i'm pretty what sure the? i really don't know i've how never heard of this this app is like i don't really know how good it is because out of any of the apps bro kill twitter yeah timu and now it has a ton of users like i don't even know if the products are good on here like i've heard some really bad shit about it to be honest with you but but it exists i guess i don't i'm never buying anything Moving on, on timu that, now, of course, we gotta talk about video games now there were a lot of insane games that came out this year like mario wonder dude that's it's way too fun. And Fortnite brought back the OG map and everyone's talking. Okay. That's probably the highlight of most of y'all's 2023. Fortnite. So many, so many memories brought back. Nostalgia. Talking about it now. But yeah, man. If the video is Spider-Man 2. Yeah, 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 yeah. Spider-Man 2. I'm grinding Fortnite or Mario Wonder. And Spider-Man 2 also came out. I mean, I'm going to be real. Bye, I don't man. even have a PS5. I, I don't even know if I'm going to get it. But I've heard pretty good things about it, though. GTA 6 was also announced this year. And I already know when it comes out, people are going to be going crazy. There was a new Kirby game. Yo, should I stream GTA when it come out, bruh? I don't know, man. Never thought myself a RP player, but listen, we could do that, bro. Game, of course. Some game called Starfield came out that I've heard a lot about. I don't, I've only played a few of the games listed, so I can't really say. Hey, why do the gamer? I, I bet. 2023, there was a lot of news that took place with like celebrities and YouTube bad, 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 creators. Bad. That Man, in 12 years <laughs> like or 50, yeah, whatever that's coming out. Jesus Christ, that like, was, bro, that was bad. Holy. 
Andrew Tate got arrested. We can't forget about that, of course. I forget the whole thing about with that. Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey. Taylor Swift fans are now buying Travis Kelsey jerseys. They spiked in 400. You for real got to start gaming? I, yo, y'all really want to see me game for real? I suck at every game I play, but listen, I'll do it just for y'all to laugh at me. <laughs> Honestly. Christ. Will I and suck, Jada bro. Pickett Smith are still in the news. That hasn't change sniper wolf doxed jack's films i, I don't know why the oh hell that yeah happened, this honest. sniper wolf hate sniper wolf is just a fucking idiot i guess i don't know there's like a whole controversy going on with rachel zelger in the snow white movie i don't really know too much about it to be honest with you i just know that that's unfolding i guess but yeah now nah, the whole travis kelsey thing is crazy bro like taylor swift fans are gonna be burning the jerseys when travis like ends up breaking up with her if that does happen there's gonna be herds of taylor swift fans like at his ain't nobody give a f about taylor swift was, like trying to barge his door down oh yeah i know we don't Cardi right yet? still not dropped yet bro what is going on dude what is, what is this doing you know what bro we're not gonna talk about that but in my opinion though the best thing to come out of 2023 by far has got to be gore lock the dis Get out of here, bro. Get out of here, bro. Get out of here, bro.